Hello, this is Sandra Hart at Life Over 60, and this video today is very important for 93 reasons. Life goes down when it sparkles. I want you around. It's alright when money's tight. Fuck the riches It's all in your eyes Hello again. This is Sandra at Life Over 60. Today is a very special video for me because my husband, Arthur, and some of you who follow me know who he is, celebrated last week his 93rd birthday. And that's really quite a milestone. When Arthur was 90, my son, who is a singer-songwriter, Emerson Hart, decided that he really wanted to give a tribute to his stepfather, Arthur. And he began writing a full album in honor of Arthur. Now I kind of have to give you a little bit of history of me, if you don't know it. You know, my husband, my late husband, suffered from uh, paranoid schizophrenia, and uh, he was killed when my son was very, very small. He was about eight years old. So basically, my son grew up without a father until Arthur came into our lives. Arthur was, had never been married before. He uh, had no ex-wives, no, no children, and he more or less took my son under his wing as his father. He always uh, encouraged him to be the best that he could be. He bought him his first guitar of his own. He started playing on my uh, guitar, my Yamaha that I had, acoustic guitar. But Arthur bought him his first guitar, his first computer, where he learned to compose music when he was probably 10 years old. He was writing music before that. But Arthur always encouraged his talent and actually was one of his best champions. My son moved to L.A. in the... Uh, mid-90s and worked at his craft but he fell in love while he was there with a girl that was a little bit older than he was and um, he was so young he was 20 years old at the time and he wrote me a song to explain to me just exactly how he was feeling and why he was so in love and why I should accept that this girl wanted to get married. Well, to make a long story short, <laughs> that song in 1997 became a multi-platinum song. It was the most played song on rock radio of that year. He won the Billboard Award, won all kinds of awards for that song. And that was in his first album called Lemon Parade. So Arthur actually has been his champion from the very beginning. As a matter of fact, when he wrote that song, Arthur took an ad from the newspaper, and it was, I think, Goodies used to be a big music uh, store where in New York, you know, where you could buy all kinds of records. And he pasted, If You Could Only See The Way She Loves Me, as number one hit. And that was before it was even released. That's how much faith Arthur had in my son Emerson. So the time has finally come. It's been three years in the making, but today my son is releasing the first song from his album that he has dedicated to his stepfather Arthur, and it's called Lucky One. 
The name of the album is 32,000 Days because when he started writing the album, he figured out 32,900 days equals 90 years. So he has named the album 32,000 Days. And another unique thing about this album is that he was figuring out what he was going to do for the album cover. And uh, I told him about a painting that Arthur did uh, when he was working and very frustrated. And every day in his office, he would go in when he got all frustrated and, and had some, believe it or not, magic markers and would uh, put things on this canvas. And it turned out to be the most unusual piece of artwork, the one and only thing he has ever done in his entire life. So I told my son, you have to see this painting if you don't remember it. And I took a picture of it and sent it to him. And he said, Mother, he says, that's it. That is going to be the album cover. And I think Arthur has titled the painting called Frustration <laughs> because at the time he was really frustrated. But anyway, I am so excited because of Arthur reaching this milestone and my son dedicating this album to him and the wonderful things that he has said about Arthur in the public relations uh, piece that has come out. And I'm going to put all of this below the video, all the links to Lucky One, to his album, and to what he says about Arthur. Life is very strange, and uh, we never know, and I've always said this before, we never know what is going to be happening tomorrow. We don't know what our next chapter is going to be. But I never dreamed that um, I would marry a lifelong bachelor. <laughs> he was 57 when he got married, and I was 45. So you never know who is going to come into your life. You never know what is going to happen tomorrow, as I said. So it's just, I believe, a story of faith, letting things happen in your life, and being open to all adventures, to all opportunities that come your way. I couldn't be more proud of all of my children, and I couldn't be more proud of my husband, Arthur, and all that he has achieved. I am just delighted that Emerson has been able to do this album uh, and to have continued success in his career all of these years. So hooray for all the men in my life, and I couldn't be happier. So today really is a big celebration. It's the release of his first song from the album, the album, 32,000 Days, uh, is uh, available in pre-order and will be out at the middle of December. It will be released in vinyl and CD, and you'll be able to stream and download the whole album. Thank you so much for joining me today uh, while I reminisce and show my fluff my proud mother fe feathers today. I hope you do something good for yourself. Be kind to someone who crosses your path today. And of course, don't forget to share the love. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you for joining me, and I hope to see you in my next video. In black and white, you bring color.